Welcome back. Don't Starve Adventures. All right, so we got some work to do. We're going to make a bunch of these traps. We're going to go lay them all out. And then we're going to come back and... Uh, we need to... Oh, cool. Free meat. Free meat. Here it comes. Here it comes. Here it comes. We got to be quick. Got to be quick. Got to be quick. Got to be quick. The monsters, are, the monsters are even quicker. <laughs> or the spiders are even quicker. Mine. There we go. Yeah. Look at them. My dudes. All right. Now, uh, what was I saying? Uh, so, yes, I did some research on sanity for this guy. It was, it was actually the, the, the results were, were pretty simple. He just has a low sanity, low maximum sanity. So, that's something we're going to have to work with, unfortunately. Um, we are going to... One way to uh, increase sanity that I've always kind of overlooked because of the amount of uh, uh, hunger that you end up generating from doing it is sleep. Just straight up sleep. Sleep eats up a ton of, uh, of sanity. I'm sorry, of hunger. Log suit, yes, yeah, make one of those. And so, we should still make one. <laughs> because we really should just have one. Hold on, I should just go ahead and get the, this. And then over here, we're gonna go ahead and make the football helmet. Just make sure we're geared up. So yeah, we have to manage his sanity as best we can. It just It's just a low sanity rate compared to others. That's all. That's all it is. It's not that big of a deal. It's just going to be a huge bitch to, to manage. Uh, three ropes. We're just going to use up all our stuff here. One, two, three. And his beard. We could cut it soon, I think. Or maybe we should cut it soon for this for the silk. But at the same time, I think it's probably okay if we don't. Because we are getting silk from other means. Um... So yeah, we probably okay. Restore sanity. Where should I? Where should I park it? Like over here? Should I park it like over here? Where's a good spot to to sleep? I mean, like right over here. Kind of off to the side, right? Doesn't have to be like right in the base. But come on, right there. There we go. Good. Perfect. We can sleep there. Restore sanity. It restores 50 sanity. I had to look that up actually. So that's good. That'd be easy. The healing salve, obviously I wish I would have saved some of those things, but I des desperately needed to use them. Um, so yes, traps. Let's take a look at what we have in our bags. Lots of rocks. We guys should go and ditch the rocks. Let's go throw them in here for now, because we have splint and everything in here, so it kind of makes sense. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, store this. This. <laughs> wow. <laughs> we got a lot of rocks, man. Actually, yeah, see, damn, I, I really wish this stupid game would just sort them on their own, on its own. Uh oh, I have a package. I'm gonna actually leave you guys hanging for just a second while I go and get this. Okay, so that was like 30 minutes that it passed. Obviously, I cut all that stuff out. Uh, let's go ahead and actually continue doing what we're doing. I'll explain what happened because it's kind of interesting, actually. Uh, we're gonna do a little bit more, just kind of dropping off some things. Uh, we'll, I guess we'll pick up those seeds. Uh, let's see, I got some pieces of gold. I don't necessarily need to bring those with me. So we're gonna do that as well. I'm gonna go into this mode just so I can keep this stuff in check. And then we're gonna move. Let's see. Man, moving the damn. Don't those stack to. Oh, they don't. Okay, cool. We'll go and grab this. We'll leave it here. It's fine. I don't necessarily need that much room. Um, we move this down here because these are the things that we're gonna, like, gonna be getting rid of. Uh, we don't need to cut. We're not gonna trim our beard anytime very soon. Ah, uh, do do do. Just basically making room so that I can. Nope. Don't need the charcoal right now. And we're gonna plant this right now. Good. All right, cool. So that frees up a lot of space. Uh, yeah, we're gonna make a whole bunch of these of these things and then put them all over the place of these traps. So, um, so what happened? <laughs> so it turns. So I had a package I was supposed to deliver. It's it's a hundred and eight inch roll of photography paper. It's like twenty five or thirty yards uh, in length, and it's it's basically just a big ass piece of like construction paper. It's a hundred and eight inches in length. It's freaking huge, right? You cannot miss it. Um, the oh, it's already six out here. Perfect. The FedEx guy accidentally delivered to the wrong address. Every neighbor <laughs> I have, including myself, we have cameras all over the place, right? We're kind of a paranoid neighborhood, right? Um, and. The camera is all like the cameras that I've checked so far from my neighbors. They all kind of nicely overlap uh, where I can see that the FedEx guy did not come to my neighborhood. I don't need to prototype that right now. I can just make them awesome. Um, they get a lot more grass though. Damn, we might sleep through the night, which means we need more grass. 
which means we get more food. Oh boy, we're in trouble. Uh, so, you know what? I know how to get more food. No, I don't. I was gonna say I could, I could trigger a, a war between the two, the two opposing factions over there at my base. But that would, uh, not, not, I need food to get started on that, which it means, it means I need meat. So I need to capture something and kill it and then go feed me. And then I can basically get a bunch of guys to murder each other. That's the ideal way of doing it. Anyways, uh, so I have one more neighbor that has a camera parked or a camera that's looking directly at the house because the FedEx guy came to that. That was the FedEx guy that came to my house. And he says, he's like, I delivered it to this guy because I, and I know I did because it was just yesterday and the house is super obvious. It's one of those homes you don't forget because it's like completely decked out in nothing but security cameras. It's almost like a parody of somebody that is over the top with security. That's how many security cameras this guy has. Obviously a lot of them are fake, but some of them are very clearly functional as well. Um, so he said he talked to the neighbor. The neighbor said, no, I don't know what you're talking about. And I'm inclined to believe that no random person would just go up and steal from this person's house because it's so completely covered in cameras. Why would anybody risk it? Especially somebody that doesn't know the area. Um, so I went over there, knocked on the door. There was no answer. Even though there's like 10 cars outside, somebody is definitely home. Um, they did not answer. I stood outside of their house for about 20 minutes on the phone, just to basically a little bit of intimidation, right? <laughs> and, um, nothing. So the next step for me is, well, first I'm going to file a claim, uh, to get my money back because that thing costs, because that paper costs like a hundred dollars. Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and talk to my other neighbor who has the, who has the camera's pointed at, at that neighbor's house. And I'm going to see if they have footage so we could see what actually happened to the package because there is a camera pointed directly. Like, it's one of those cameras that basically he's pointing it across the street, you know? Oh, put it on, though. <laughs> I wish it would just, like, immediately put it on. Um, but yeah, so that's so... So, so I'm, I'm very curious to see what happens. Like, once I check, I mean, if, you know, some neighbors, you know, they, they, they don't actually have anything going on with their, with their cameras. It's just kind of fake, right? Which I think is silly. If you have cameras, use them. Oh my god, it's actually getting cold. Yes, yeah, that's why we need this. Let's make a bunch. He's gonna get cold. We might have to make a fire. Okay, next hole. Wow. I can't, uh, this has got to be like a pre, is, oh, oh no, don't do, don't, well, I made it already, so, rip. Make this one. There we go. Man, man. I don't need the poop yet, so we'll just go ahead and get that thing burning. So yeah, it's exciting times. Well, I'm wasting this torch to see if I could go ahead and... I don't want to get too involved with that. Okay, I guess we'll just wait here and just burn through this torch and just hang out for the rest of the night. So yeah, wow, I cannot, I cannot wait. I'm very, I'm, I'm very intrigued. It's like, does this make, is a neighbor lying or did somebody really come by and steal a 108 inch long box? Which just sounds absurd. That is like, what is that? Seven, eight, almost like nine feet, eight, nine feet, something like that. Right? Let me see. No, more than that. Well, nine, that's 98 inches. So it's nine and a half feet, give or take. Um, but actually, no, because the box is going to be longer than the paper. So it's basically, it's, yeah, it's basically 10 feet. Like, uh, yeah, like 11 or, uh, um, nine and a half to 10 feet. That's crazy. Nobody would steal that. But benefit of the doubt, I'll give my, I'll give it to my neighbor. Benefit of the doubt, right? We should do as a good neighbor. Don't want to go over there and just start throwing around. I got three here. Um, accusations. And my wife is like, just get the refund. I was like, what? And not solve this mystery? You're crazy. <laughs> I'm going to solve the shit out of this mystery. I'm going to expose them. <laughs> Actually, I'm, 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 I am hoping that somebody just ended up stealing it because that would be kind of funny like 
The only way you could carry that thing out of here is if you were to have a... Hey, look, there's that guy that... Yeah, house too. Um, the only way you could actually get it out of here is if you had a truck. You can't put that shit in a Honda Civic. <laughs> yeah, that's just not happening. It's just not happening. We gotta get these things out quick. And we'll actually get those caught right away. It's kind of a waste doing so many, but it is what it is. One. Oh, he actually missed it. Crap. Let me put this one up. And then put it in a better spot, like right here. Like that. <gasps> what the? Okay, well this one got it. Good. See, so, yeah, we can just leave it here and then come back in another year. <laughs> Put it a little closer, right here. Oh, give me a break. Yeah, I see. Not the most reliable systems. Here we go. We'll have to come back every once in a while. I have to remember to come back every once in a while. That's gonna be the biggest problem. Unfortunately, we have to kill some of these guys already. Oh, wow. Not yet, huh? Oh, there's actually no dudes out here. That's odd. That's really odd. I'm gonna get these seeds. I need all the food I can get right now. Actually, let's go ahead and do this. Let's see. Cook. And eat. They're already. They're already. Oh, here we go. Okay, cool. We got there, the other one trigger. Nope, okay. More seeds. Take them. I'll eat them. It's time for a snack. He says as he picks up the uh, rabbit. Should be one more over here that should be triggered. That top one, I believe, hasn't spit out a rabbit yet. Right? Was it the top one? Pretty sure it was. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, we don't want to scare him away. We need to scare him into the trap. Ah. Can't miss. Can't miss, right? Ah, oh, damn it. Alright, that's the end of that. Okay, so we have four. Oh man, it's already starting to get cold. Unbelievable. God, did we, did we just start this early last time? Jesus, I'm so mad. Here, how far am I? I mean, I'm not far, far, but I have to go all the way up and around. That's kind of the bitch about this whole setup, is I have to go so far and around. <clears throat> yeah, we have to do it. So yeah, what we're going to do is get our two factions warring here, uh, at war. Oh, it warmed up. That's strange. Because of my beard, perhaps? my beard just get longer? <laughs> I think it did. <laughs> just bought myself a little bit extra time. I don't have enough poop for... This is one... Really just one beefalo there. Yeah, I don't have enough poop to uh, support. Did I go the right way? No. Damn. Can't make any farms or anything yet. But if winter's coming, then there's really no point in making farms right now. Especially given how close winter is, even if it's not coming right now, which it shouldn't be. Still. That really depleted our stick stock. I don't know if we have any, any reserve. That's why I moved all the sticks. That's something that... One thing that you kind of tend to forget. That you need a whole lot of. <laughs> Alright, so this should be easy. We basically... We trigger one group. And we'll go from there. Yeah, I need all this food, damn it. I hate when it comes down to the wire like this, where it's like 
Neal is going to be... Oh, good. Two tier twos. This should be interesting. Murder, murder. Okay. Then we're going to give my boy here. Let's see. Give. There you go. Then we bring him over here. And we say... Uh, we'll get back a little bit. Make sure we get that attack. There we go. Attack. Oop. But don't actually attack. Step back a little bit and let them fight it out. Oh, perfect. And then he takes one hit. Now all the spiders... No, oh, no. We should get more spiders. We should get more angry spiders. There they go. That's what I want to see. No? Huh? What are you guys doing? No, no, no. You're supposed to fight. To the death. Oh my gosh. What the heck? That was not at all the way that was supposed to go. Let me cook it. Cook these things real quick. Eat. I'm about to murder another one. Let me see. <clears throat> Try one more time here. Give. Okay, now come on over here, bud. Oh, here we go. Perfect. Perfect. That'll piss off everybody, right? Surely we're gonna get a, a big, nice big fight going. Spider glands. Oh man, this is not as, not as good as I thought it would be. That's, that's actually quite <laughs> the opposite of what I wanted. <laughs> I need them to kill each other so I can eat their food, eat their meats. And now look, now I'm, I'm stuck with basic ass food. Stupid rabbits. Like a murder. Murder. Now let's eat it myself. Basically threw away two pieces of food. Alright. <clears throat> Damn. Let's see. Well, at least we know we can get... We have plenty of protection. If all these guys are not going to kill each other, then they'll hang out. Uh, oh, let's see. Let's get the mushrooms. So you don't starve mushrooms. We're gonna get the stats from this because I just I've already forgotten. All right, let's see. So I have a blue cap and a green cap. Green cap will give me plus twelve hunger, but minus fifty sanity. Yikes! Uh, cooked green cap will give me a little bit of sanity. So the green cap is actually kind of useless for me right this second. Blues are usually pretty good though. Blue, yeah, a little bit of sanity drop, good hunger, good health. Actually, it'll top me off. Oh my god, it's winter already. <gasps> I am not prepared. Oh my god. Okay, let's, uh, what was it? Cook, was it cook blue cap? Yeah, cook blue cap. Let's go ahead and, where would, where would it go? Let's get it out here. Before that fire goes out. Oh my god. Take. This is, this is like six days too soon. Uh, I think. I mean, I could be wrong. I thought, I thought it was like 20, day 20 to 21 that you actually get it. Um, uh, eat. Uh, what fixes the sanity? Does fix the hunger, obviously. <laughs> I'm supposed to eat it raw. Oh my god. Uh, I can't, I just, yeah, I can't hang right now. My mind is clearly all and just engrossed in trying to expose my neighbors for being liars. <laughs> uh, let's see. Did it, did it, did it, did it. What do I do? What do I do? I'm going to make a thermal stone uh, pickaxe. I basically have everything just at the wrong place. Okay. So let's go ahead and warm it up. We'll drop this right there. What do we do? What do we prototype? Um, there's really nothing I can prototype to stay warm longer. <laughs> what I need to do is actually go get some more food. And I mean, there's lots of a bunch of berries actually around here. Let's just go do, do a lap. After this thing gets nice and toasty warm, uh, maybe white hot if we can. We'll go for a quick lap and uh, see what we can pick up. But yeah, that's that's the end of so many things. <laughs> Which suck. The thing white hot? It looks pretty hot. Red hot. I'll take red hot. Yeah, like all all this stuff is not gonna grow now, and I again like I'm not I'm not totally prepared for this. I'll be able to make like a fistful of jam at least, but that's not gonna really help me too much. Might have to fight that beefalo. The one beefalo. You know what, mushroom? Let's get you out of there. Got two of them. Okay, cool. That's I'll, I'll help a lot. Especially during the day because I could just I could tank that um or mitigate the insanity or the sanity drop pretty easily. Oh, 
Oh yeah, there's lots of stuff on here. I mean, it, it is, I did call it the Horn of Plenty, didn't I? Lots of sticks, lots of all kinds of stuff. I should actually go through and collect all of this stuff and, and pile it all up and make a nice big collection. Oh, pangles are back. I am, I am in utter disbelief that winter has started already. I really truly am. But it's entirely possible that the last playthrough it did and it just feels like it's early for some reason. <laughs> but Mike B, it's like this all the time. Well, maybe I just forgot, okay? I could still be shocked. <laughs> Uh, let's see. Good. Oh yeah, we got lots of lots of berries, and we can uh, we can make something out of them, or we can just cook them, and it will be. What does a red cap do? Red cap gives me minus twenty health. Okay, red cap is just basically garbage. Sacrifice health for hunger? No thanks. Not yet, anyways. Stone is still warm. It's got to be this big silky beard. By the way, good thing I did not shave it. I would have been heap of trouble right now. Jeez. Oh, <laughs> Is there another? There might be another down here. We're gonna need gears, by the way. We, should, we gotta get a fridge up. I realize that it's icy cold out here, and everything could probably just. Everything should technically be able to stay fresh while sitting outside on the ground. But that's not the way video games work. Progression. Progression, progression. That's the red, right? That just dipped down in there into the ground? I think so. Yeah, red. Again, that's the useless one. And that looks like a green. The greens give me... If I eat a raw, I'll, it'll really, really hurt my... Yeah, I'll leave it there. It'll hurt, but... The cooked one actually give me a little bit of sanity. We could do that. Yeah, let's do that. A little bit of sandy for a tiny little bit of, yeah, cook, and then eat. Sandy boost. Cool. <clears throat> Sucks that he doesn't get um, any kind of health or any kind of sanity increase with the, uh... Sorry, I'm thinking here. Um, yeah, just, he doesn't get any kind of sanity increase by hugging a fire. Like a nice big warm fire, you would think that'd be the, that'd be the ticket, but it's, it's not. So let's do this. Let's go ahead and, uh, we're gonna, uh, cook. Cook, 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 cook. And then we're going to do that. And we'll do the same thing for these berries here. Just basically get everything cooked. And then we're going to go to sleep in the tent. Well, no, not yet. Actually, my sanity is still pretty good. Pretty high. So I don't want to waste it. You only really get a handful of uses out of it anyways. <clears throat> good. Yeah, that's some good food right there. Good eats. I'm going to eat that now. Cook, cook, cook. Nice to make a couple of these. Might as well go ahead and fire this guy up. Uh, did we ever determine if a, if, a, if a plank lasts longer than a handful of logs? I'm sure someone did the math. Let's just go and just throw it in just, just the logs. The hammer being so close changes the interact point of the of the fire. Like the range of being able to interact with the fire it's kind of dangerous because i might i might one day need to hurry up and start a fire <laughs> and i won't be able to so we'll go pick that up we'll put it in like something else in here for now you know what i'm saying and anytime i throw something in a, in a bin that doesn't necessarily have anything that's similar to it in it i keep i keep saying well put it here for now for now for now we'll move it eventually guys right And then we'll eat this. Uh, and one more will just top me off, but let's just go ahead and save it. It lasts up to 12 days, so we'll cook that and eat it instead. Eat. Perfect. Okay, so I believe we're good to go in terms of time. Uh, sorry I had to cut off right in the middle of the episode there, but, uh, but you know, weird weirdness with the neighbors. Uh, I don't know if next time I'll have an update, <laughs> so we'll have to see. Um... But, yeah, obviously I will keep you guys abreast of the situation if I have not already resolved it uh, and talked about it via Twitter, which is probably going to happen, I'm sure. Uh, but that's it. So we're good here. This is a good stopping point. We have a tent. We have, um, we, we're going to do another uh, loop to go and pick up all of the, 
all of the leftover, all of the uh, the rabbits that we should be collecting now. We should have like six of them, right? Uh, and then we'll be able to probably start making our little farm, which means we probably should go ahead and prototype a wall of some sort. A hay wall. How about a wood wall? That's really expensive. How about a stone wall? Do I have... I have lots of stone. Lots of stone. Maybe we should actually think about investing in... Yeah, look at that. We have so much of this. And we're not going to run out of it anytime soon. So yeah, I think what we'll do is we'll prototype a stone wall. Um, and that will be... How we go about containing all of our new... I guess they're going to be the fluffy rabbits, right? Yeah, like the, the or the, the white rabbits, the snow rabbits. So yeah, we'll have, have a nice little, just a little ranch with them. We'll put them in the... Um, uh, in the stone walls, just, I mean, just as a means to keep them all together and to make sure that they don't necessarily escape because spiders do have a tendency to attack walls at random. Uh, so we'll probably put them a little bit, kind of far away, but far enough away uh, that I could just basically slide in there, get, you know, whatever it is I need from them, um, you know, pick up a rabbit and kill it <laughs> and then cook it. Uh, we might be able to collect other things too. We may be able to collect other uh, rabbits and start using those uh huh not rabbits but like other other animals what else what else can i put in there actually we'll have to wait and see because just about everything is hostile to me so i can't really just go and like farm things but we'll have to work it out and see what i can stuff in there maybe a maybe uh some pigs or something like that <laughs> we'll see ah uh, that's it all right my name is mike b thank you for listening to me rant about neighbors and stuff and packages being missing uh, thanks for watching, of course. I'll see you guys later. Bye.